Ayla Ferguson and Elijah Cook love coming to school. More importantly, they both love the support they receive from their teachers. When presented with the assignment to create a Shark Tank business during summer experience, their group chose to help those who inspire and encourage them every day. Teachers. Teach Mart is the business that my group and I created that is directed towards teachers and school administrators for purchasing school supplies. I think them having a resource as well as them providing a resource for us is a blessing. Middle school students enjoying summer experience at Buckeye Middle School all came up with creative ways to establish a business tackling problems plaguing their school communities and pitched solutions. Their business proposals were presented to a group of panelists, local community business owners, along with Columbus Board of Education President Jennifer Adair. Our kids really took the assignment to heart and they were solving problems that they found in their community, uh, with their own age group, and really wanting to help others. And you know, that's what's really amazing, um, that our kids can take a problem, try to solve it, and then be entrepreneurs along the way. The Shark Tank project is part of a broader push to incorporate the district's portrait of a graduate and its six pillars. Communications, adaptability, technology, creativity, critical thinking, and global empathy in student engaging curriculums. As students learn and graduate, we want them to be able to exhibit those attributes. And this is a perfect example of how we use technology and how we use um, empathy even in some of these presentations and how the kids were able to really take what they've learned and implement it into a project. And so this is a perfect example of how our portrait really works in the real world. Students created business proposals from lawn care services, clothing boutiques, to a school snack convenience store. Developing these business plans inspired Elijah so much that he created his own business with help from his parents. My business is called Big East Lawn Care Service. In my business, what I do is I split the money three different ways. Um, inventory and expense, marketing, and then myself. Learning what it means to be an entrepreneur, the hope is that these students take what they've learned in the classroom and apply it in their lives. I think it is really good that I'm learning about entrepreneurship, especially at my age, because right now you also can see that there is a lot of kids who have their own business, and learning about it makes me more interested in starting a business.